This is 2019, question number 22, and we are told in the figure below, the figure below represents a triangular for our garden, ABC, in which AB is equal to 4 meters, BC is equal to 5 meters, that is BC, and uh, angle BAC, that is angle C there, is 30 degrees. Point D lies on AC such that uh, uh, such that BD is 4 cm and angle BDC is obtuse. Now, the question is find correct to two decimal places uh, angle BDC. So, this is the angle that we are interested in. And because we have been given the side BC, which is 5 cm, and we are given BD, which is 4 cm. And the angle at C, we can use the sign rule and say 4, that is that 4, divided by the opposite uh, angle of that side is 30 degrees, is equal to 5, divided by the sign of angle D, or angle, you can say angle D. So when you rearrange this, you find that uh, sign D is equal to, uh, 5 you cross multiply here 5 sine 5 sine 30 divide by 4 and you get this is equals to uh, you get this is uh, 0 0.6 uh, 250 uh, so that is so we get the sine inverse sine inverse of this sine inverse of d of uh, not d but uh, 0 0.6250 it give you uh, that the eight point six eight degrees. But we have been told that uh, uh, D is obtuse. That is more uh, an angle greater than ninety. And since the, in the second quadrant uh, sine is positive, so this means that the angle uh, the angle D is uh, in the second quadrant, which is obtuse. So it is equals to 180 minus uh, that the 8.68 uh, which will give you this will give you uh, 141 141.32 uh, degrees so that is the angle D and that is how you get it uh, you get to part B so part B we are told the length AD so this is the length AD and uh, going back since we have obtained angle bdc it is equals to 141.32 uh, when you subtract that from 180 this angle then it is uh, 38.68 uh, and because this side is equals to this it is an isosceles triangle it means this angle is also 38.68 uh, since we have these two triangles, we can get this one, 180 minus 2, uh, 2 times uh, uh, that 8.62, this angle you get, it is equal to 102.64. Uh, now we have this angle, uh, we have these other two angles, so we are looking for the opposite side of this angle. So we can use the sign rule and say uh, AD that is our the, wrong, the side that we are looking for divide by the sign of uh, the sign of the angle opposite that side which is 102.64 is equals to uh, 4 divided by that is the either of this 4 uh, and the angle opposite is at the 8.4 then we say sign that the 8.68 uh, implying our ad can be obtained by multiplying 4 cross multiply we get the sine 102.64 uh, uh, all this is divided by sine uh, that the 8.68 and using your calculator when you compute that you'll be able to get uh, 6.25 centimeters so that is how you get ad uh, i'm trying to save space here because I don't have uh, in a, a lot of space so that is how you work it out uh, but you still get the full mark part C it's telling us uh, length we find the length of DC uh, so this is the length DC and we have this angle is 30 
and th this uh, this angle here we have found it is 141.32 uh, when you add the two uh, you get uh, this is uh, 171.171.32 171 you subtract from 180 uh, you subtract from 180 to get uh, this angle here uh, that is angle B and when you subtract that you should be able to get uh, this is uh, 8 this is 6 uh, 8.8.68 degrees so this angle here B is 6 point, uh, 8 point not 6 uh, 8.68 once you get that angle you can apply the sine rule and say our DC over the sine of that uh, the, the angle that angle that is angle B sine 8.68 should be equals to uh, 4 divided by the opposite side which is uh, sine 30 so here we are being tested whether we understand the sine rule so implying that the DC is equals to 4 uh, sine 8.68 divided by sine 30 and when you compute that you get DC is equals to 1.21 centimeter so that's how you work out that and you get yourself two marks finally part D we are told the area of the flower garden the area we can use uh, the sign uh, the, uh, the, the, the method of the sign rule which is we say it is area is equals to a b uh, that is uh, a, 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 a half a b sin theta so we need this angle here angle a angle a b c and we get that angle by adding uh, this angle that the 8.68 and angle 30 and you subtract from 180 you get the total angle here that is the angle a b d and b d b c the total angle there will be 111 111 uh, point uh, that is good point three two that is when you add one one or two one or two point which we obtained here one or two point uh, two and you add to eight point eight eight point six eight so we can get the area is equals to a half multiplied by this is a uh, this is a uh, uh, this means that area we can get the area area is equals to a half multiplied by one side which is four centimeter multiplied by the other side which is five centimeter the sign of uh, the angle in between which is one 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 point three two degrees so using you can simplify here you get two uh, using your calculator when you compute that you'll be able to get uh, area is equals to nine point three two uh, centimeter squared so that's how you work out that question I hope you have followed and uh, uh, this you can note that uh, we have actually utilized the sign rule that is a knowledge that you need to have when you are using uh, when you are solving this question we also also know uh, there are three methods of solving uh, getting the area of a triangle and the one that we have used is one one of them so we have a half uh, a b sine theta that is the angle included in inclusive angle of the two sides given so that that, that brings us to the end hope you have gotten what uh, is supposed to be done uh, keep on watching